Just like humans, dogs are living longer. So we're seeing more arthritis in dogs than ever before. And one new way of relieving those aches and pains is drawing on research done on Minnesota dogs as part of a nationwide study. You're a nice boy. So he's been feeling pretty good. Creature and his owner, Kathy, drove all the way from Fargo for his vet checkup. And Creature had a shoulder injury when he was just a couple years old, and he had been developing quite a bit of arthritis in it. Well, let's take a peek at you, my little friend. See how you're feeling. So why make the drive to the Inver Grove Heights Animal Hospital? Good job, handsome. Good job, buddy. It's the only vet in Minnesota taking part in a nationwide stem cell study for dogs with arthritis. Nice job. They get the same things that adult humans get, which is arthritis, um, aches and pains. Pains, joint issues. They limp, they get up slowly. For vets like Dr. Ann Valenti, this study could be a game changer. It helps to, we're hoping, um, maybe create some cells in the joints that will help to provide some pain relief. Half the dogs in the study get the stem cells, the other half get a placebo. Actually, we're checking his mobility, his range of motion. Dr. Valenti won't know which one's for a year, but she's already noticing some changes. Feels really good. Body condition is perfect. I have seen some dogs that I go, I think in my head, well, I don't think they got it, and then I have have other dogs that I think, oh, I think for sure they did. Good boy. And now we're going to take him out for a lameness exam. Today is Creature's last checkup for the study. There we go. Come on, buddy. I actually do think, I'm hoping it's not the placebo, and I wasn't seeing things, but I actually do think that um, we have seen improvement in his bad shoulder. Nice. Wow, he looks great. He actually is moving very nicely in his shoulder. Seeing improvements in Creature is worth the drive itself, but for Kathy, it's about the bigger picture of this nationwide study. Oh, beautiful. So any chance that there's research or anything like that, I'm always up for that. What we learn from this study can help a lot of dogs in the future. Chee chee. Oh, yes. <laughs> this is what I went to vet school for, you know, to help animals. And so if I can be on the cutting edge of medicine with them, I think that's fantastic. <laughs> they love their dogs there. And something kind of cool, all of the dogs in the study will eventually get the stem cell treatment. So if they got the placebo this time, they will get that real medicine later. This is still at least a year away from FDA approval, but what they learned from this study in dogs could be helpful for humans with arthritis down the line. So if you've got a dog uh, that's a little bit older with arthritis, we did put more information on this study at WCCO.com. And I was just with uh, my family dogs last weekend who have arthritis. And you mm. see it, you know, the, the slowness. And it's just, it's about giving them kind of that better quality of life toward the end of their life. Yeah, it's tough. You look at, uh, I think any dog owner mm -hmm. will make that choice where you say, like, geez, the cost of care right. versus, sure. you know, the quality other the quality of life. But with arthritis, you know that, like, the dog is fine. They're fine. They're going to live just, several more it's years. It's joints if you can make a difference. And they said it's phenomenal. And this is a nationwide study, but they said, especially for dog owners in Minnesota, you know, being out on the ice oh, with the dog, just walking cold. down the sidewalk. Sure. It's, you know, our dogs are a Hunting, little more active. All of that stuff. Yeah. Exactly. So mm. really cool that it's happening here. Yeah. Very cool. Good story. Thanks, Kathleen.